Let's take a look at some of the design features that are embedded within Google Slides. So I have this slide here, looks okay, but there are some things that I want to do to it. And the first is that I want this image here to be centered. So you'll notice as I move the image on the page, some red lines pop up showing me that this image is now aligned with created by Lacey Bryant up here at the top. And if I keep moving it, eventually a red line will pop up showing, there it is, that the image is in the center of the page. I can also move the image up and down and you'll see the crosshairs align to show me that this image is exactly in the middle of the page. So this is nice to do for some of those final touches, but there is another way to do this. So let me throw this image in this bottom right hand corner. An alternative and easier way to center an image is to right click on an image and highlight center on page and then select horizontally or vertically. And Google Slides will put the image in the center of the page for you. So let me move this down so that's not on top of the final thoughts. And let me show you how to do this with text. I want this text box to eventually end up on the bottom centered below my image. But there's a few things that I need to do to make sure it's exactly in line. And the first is that I want to center the text within the box itself. So I've got my cursor blinking. I'm going to go here and center my text. This will ensure that wherever I put this blue box on the page, if the box is centered and the text is centered within the box, then the text is going to be centered. So I, in addition, I'm also going to just make the box smaller for myself. What I'll need to do now that the text is centered is right click on the box and tell it to center on the page horizontally. And then I'm gonna grab this text keeping it aligned with this red line in the middle and just move it to the place where I want the created by Lacey Bryant to appear. I'm going to move it all the way down below this little girl. So now what we have is an image that is properly centered on the page and text that is also centered on the page and the text and the image are also centered with each other. This is one way that you can make your presentation look really good and have a nice finished product.